Come in and park yourself on the hide, son. Hell, my daddy used to say, never look a gift horse in the mouth. And by golly, he never did. Would you like a drop of the old Kentucky? No, thanks. A clean thinker. I like that. Now, the property business isn't all about highfalutin paper pushing. It's about dirt and the will to claim that dirt. You with me, son? Oh, yeah. Well, I need some tenacious bastard to let go of some dirt. And you look to me like the kind of guy to persuade him. Persuasion's my forte. Yeah, he'll be down at the country club, down on the golf course. They don't allow guns, so his bodyguards won't be packing lawgivers. Go beat eight tons of crap out of him. Here now, I got you a membership. And boy, you're gonna need more appropriate clothing. This guy's my new friend. I never had a friend with a weight before. Please. Well, I myself love casseroles on Thanksgiving. And the way to teach your children the rich history of America is through theme parks. I just love Pilgrim World, especially the part where you get to slaughter your own buffalo and take home the meat, or give the locals the flu while buying their land off them for a pittance. That's what children need. Uh, uh, what is? Wholesome activities that benefit. Give me some... Is this me? Nice ass, baby. out to dinner we're starting from scratch even if daddy is working late again we build our own spears smear ourselves in dung and then wait in a swamp for something to come by in the sun I chose him because he had a kind face and a rich dad. I didn't know he was going to cheat on me or embarrass me. I didn't know. But I won't be made a fool of. I've got the children. Okay, Jan. It's okay. Men are idiots. Ask. What about you? Hi. Who is this guy? Boys, deal with him. Get him! Do that, I psycho! I'm going to start homeschooling my children. High school is a cult. There's a group of savages that rule the roost and get all the girls and everyone else is picked on and abused. It happened to me and look at me. I'm a deranged mess and my husband cheats on me. I don't want my kids to go to a public high school. Instead, we have a prom each year in my living room. And that leads to my next question. People in high school in Chile are all naked. I've about had it with you, Barry. I try to be fair, I try to be kind, but you are a freak and a liar and wasting everybody's time. The organs below the belt are for reproduction and removing of bodily waste. There's no reason that when I go to buy a soda or a transmission, I need to be distracted by your privates dangling about. Now, when I go to the store to buy an air conditioning filter, I'd rather not have to look at your moneymaker, amigo. I'm glad you are proud of it. But when people of Vice City are in a quickie mart, they should be able to have a simple financial transaction without seeing your fire hose. Are you with me? Sorry, Maurice. That's okay. Just try to behave. I think the sun must have got to you or something. Yes, maybe that's it. Uh, Maurice, if I may, you have a fine show here, and, and I'm glad to be on it. But everyone within the sound of my voice and smell will die in the fires of doom. It is written, TV is trash, radio is trash, our newspapers are run by Canadians with an agenda. Our very way of life is threatened. We form this great state to play golf, and I'll be damned if any weirdo hippies are going to tell us we can't fill in wetlands and make a home for ourselves, complete with 18-hole championship standard courses and selective admission. Heathens will ruin the land, acid will rain from the skies, we'll never hear my voice again, it will be anarchy. TV teaches immorality. Refugees, glue, the price of tea in China, how can we raise children in this environment? My Me, me, me! Hello? Is there a freak or something? It's a difficult question, Jan. A very difficult question. Is it right to lie? Clothes are a lie, Maurice! No, Barry. Clothes are a way of keeping warm and not getting arrested. 
No policeman has ever hit me with his truncheon. I'd like to hit you back to hell, you sicko. Your filth. Human form of vermin. A blight on a fine society, picket fences and garden parties, and everyone coming three times a day to my statue to pay home. Pastor Richards, as a human being, I have to say I find your philosophy or cult or whatever it is utterly and completely appalling. Why, thank you. I knew you'd understand. I mean, you seem to want... As I say in the great book, many a call, but unless you have a good credit rating, go screw yourself. You're burning hell. Hey, por favor, shut up. But Barry, what are you doing? I'm lonely, Maurice. Lonely, and I need some bodily contact.